right, we're going to go over um, two tests for uh, sacral dysfunction. The first is the uh, sacral spring test. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to place your hypothenar eminence onto um, the base of the sacrum. So um, I'm putting my hand like this instead of like this or like this because my hand's too wide. I can't actually get good contact to spring. Um, but what the sulci are right here. This is an uh, extremely flexed sacrum, so they're not really that deep on most people. Um, but I'm going to use that for the Sphinx test. I'll show you that after. But for the spring test, I'm going to place my hand there. I'm going to assess the springing motion um, at those joints. So you can follow the crest around. I'm going to place my hand there. And simply, um, I'm just going to push and assess to see if there's motion. Um, if there's a lack of motion, then that's a positive test. Um, there should be a little springing action. If there's pain elicited when I compress, um, that is also a positive test. Uh, the Sphinx test is um, also to uh, diagnose a um, sacral dysfunction of the uh, sacral extension. Um, what you do now is you find the sacral sulci, which is what I showed you over here on this the sulci, so it's just, um, it's on the base, it's just uh, the space above that. Um, so I'll find that on the patient. Um, and then I'm going to assess for the depth of those sulci um, and see if relative to each other they are the same. Um, and then I'm going to take note of that because when I have the patient go into the sphinx position, go to the sphinx position, um, then I'm going to assess here for uh, asymmetry again. Um, if there was uh, more asymmetry in the sphinx position, go back down, um, more asymmetry in the sphinx position than there was in the neutral position, then that would be a positive test. Um, if there was no asymmetry um, in the neutral position and then there was asymmetry in the uh, sphinx position, that's a positive test. But it's a negative test if there was um, asymmetry in the neutral position that got better in, to, in the um, sphinx position. Um, this test, if it's positive, it's indicating that the sacrum is extended. 